this is a tough one for me. Yeah. Uh, so Deshaun Jackson, who went to Cal and is currently on the Eagles, is a great wide receiver. Iggy, I don't know the technical terms, but he put stuff on the internet that was yeah. anti-Semitic. I mean, yeah. really, really bad stuff. Uh, the context, of course, is that I'm a Jewish guy. Yeah. Grant is Jewish. Yeah. I had a bar mitzvah. Grant had a bar mitzvah with Jewish people. Yeah. And when we see stuff like that, it not only makes me angry. Boy, does it make me angry. It hurts me. Mm-hmm. It hurts me and it frightens me. It frightens me. And so a little bit of Sean Jackson. Um, after he put that stuff up, Julian Edelman, a, you know, who plays for the Patriots, a Jewish guy from the peninsula, he was such a mensch. A mensch means a person. He reached out uh, to Deshaun Jackson and said, look, I admire you. I, I, I watch you play. I admire you. I like you. Come with me to the Holocaust Museum. Mm-hmm. You know, let's and then I'll go with you to your museum. Mm-hmm. And um, God love him. Uh, Deshaun Jackson apologized. And even he's going to go to Auschwitz, Mm -hmm. death death camp. So I really admire Deshaun Jackson. You know, I've said a lot of stupid things in my life. What he did was really stupid. But yeah, it was ignorant. But it doesn't necessarily mean he's racist. There's a difference, right? A bad person. Right. And he's open to learning. Wants to learn. So my issue is not with Deshaun Jackson. I want to give him a hug. Yeah. My issue is with Roger Goodell and with the local media here. So um, I, I want to say this as calmly as I can. Um, Roger Goodell, the commissioner of the NFL, espouses many good causes. He may be a very nice man. You know, l- lately he's apologized to Kaepernick really and to the black players in the NFL because of the way he and the league had handled racial consciousness and issues before, and maybe even some sort of blackballing of Kaepernick, whether or not they officially did it, I don't know. And I appreciate that he did it. Mm-hmm. But when this player on, on the on the Philadelphia Eagles comes out with all of this stuff, mm-hmm. the league did issue some kind of uh, apology. Where was Roger Goodell? I say mean, something, Roger. Say something, Roger. Stand up. Yeah. Say yeah. something, Roger. Say, you know, it's unfortunate what – uh, Deshaun Jackson said, we don't endorse things like that. We don't endorse ha- hate speech of any kind. Right. Um, that I would have appreciated that. And I want to point out, um, Mitch Alabama, the Detroit Free Press wrote uh, just a brilliant column about it. And if, if you, if you want to read on this subject, read Mitch, but a, a few points that I'd like to add is that, which he made in a way, uh, prejudice against Jews goes back a, a Thousands of years, thousands of years. We're the ones who had to flee from Egypt because we were slaves. Yep. If you don't believe me, read the Bible. Yep. In the uh, 13th century, England kicked us out for the entire Middle Ages because we were Jews. In 1492, there was the Spanish Inquisition. They kicked us out and killed a lot of us because mm-hmm. we were Jews. Uh, we, we fled to uh, Eastern Europe and for centuries lived in ghettos. Uh, in Ukraine, in Russia. In because that, those, those places didn't want us either. Didn't want us. You, you, you can't be in the town. Uh, that, that horrible ghetto where, where all the Jews were exterminated by the Nazis in Warsaw, Poland. Mm. And I would like to point out, not too long ago, the the uh, Nazis killed six million of us in, uh, in, the, in World War II in the death camps. So um, th- this is not a frivolous uh, point I'm trying to make. This is serious stuff. Uh, you know, a year or two ago, a, a, a maniac went in and killed all those people in a synagogue in um, Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh and pointed out uh, uh, what happened in uh, in the rabbi's house. The guy came in and and killed somebody. That's killed five people. people. Uh, that was on, that was just a few months ago during Hanukkah in New York. Hanukkah. So this is serious stuff, and I would like to think that Roger Goodell would think it rises up to the level of talking about. Uh, Black Lives Matter. Uh, not. I don't want to exclude. I'm just saying include us too. Um, For the you same know, reason that he felt it necessary to make a statement about all the things that's going on with black people, as he should have and needed to, same yes, thing applies here. I would think so. This happened in his league. 
Um, I would also like to say, you know, the journalists around here, not Iggy, these are our friends. And I, I'm not saying anybody's an anti-Semite or anything like that, but I read, you know, in, in the paper, uh, applauding uh, the, the league and the Redskins for changing the, the name of the Redskins. Fine, of course. I can imagine it must be very upsetting for a Native American for a team to be called the Redskins. Where was the outrage about Deshaun Jackson? Yeah. I'm saying it's fair to be outraged about the Washington team. And it's fair to be outraged about what's happening to black men, let's say. But what about us? Uh, how come n people don't talk about that? And I want to say one other thing. I guess I'm getting really pissed off, all right? Um, you should be pissed. I'm pissed. 